Uh, certainly uh, the faces are pretty and everything else. Why wouldn't you want to have that in your mix with action figures? Um, so it's quite nice and you can pose it pretty well. So this does pass the action figure articulation uh, rule. And obviously there are cloth on here so it makes it look realistic. But there is that problem which is irrefutable. I don't know what was in their heads, uh, why they wouldn't want to make a little larger feet here. But you definitely are going to have to put this in some sort of holder or stand, which generally is a good idea anyway with your action figures. If they tend to stand on their own for long periods of time, the joints tend to get messed up and they don't fit well. Uh, this is true with uh, many G.I. Joe figures, particularly a lot of the... Um, junkier G.I. Joe figures that are made by Hasbro, blow mold types, other ones um, tend to, if they stand on their feet uh, and not in a stand to support them, the joints start to get bad. So something you should uh, definitely note. So this is a cool figure. It's a fun figure and uh, it comes with those neat little accessories uh, uh, and um, those in themselves may be something you want uh, to add to whatever. So watch for, we have many more. I can't wait to show the actual ghost hunting figures and the cool accessories that come with that and actually the ghost hunting kind of center. Uh, these are really cool. I think that this should be taken into consideration in the future that we should make these toys a little more interesting other than guns and grenades, uh, which get a little tiresome. Uh, there should be much more martial arts figures with different outfits and everything else. There's been a little bit of this out there, but um, it seems to be a neglected area. Uh, why there isn't kung fu outfits, why there isn't different karate style outfits and different types of martial arts weapons. I mean, some of this has been done, but I don't see much of it happening in general. So, as usual, leave it to Mattel to make high quality good stuff uh, with always some sort of bizarre addition. Until next time.